Hi guys, uh, I wanted to just come on here and say, sorry, had to adjust the camera, had to come on here and say we did wonderful today considering it was our first day of not only trying to raise funds for this feed store that we are trying to build, um, but also just overall, we were able to get a lot of the programs that we had at our current location that um, is unfortunately closing again. Um, this business, there, there is no saving it. I'm, I'm so sorry to say for those of you who know the business, who know everything, I'm so sorry. There, there is no saving this business. But we can start anew and we can start fresh. And with this new one, it will include more of horses. It will include more of that. That is the goal. But um, what we do have now is we have talked to the um, adoption play, adoption uh, services that we had at this location. And we talked to them, we fleshed it out more, and we've come to an agreement that they can be more involved in the new business in this new fresh start, they can be more involved and have a part in the educational program that we are planning to make a part of this. So part of it is going to be feed, supply, grain, so on and so forth. Um, and then part of it is going to be the educational purposes. So letting people know about how to raise animals, how to care for animals that you have. If you're just starting off with a litter of kittens, know how to do it and on the side have the supplies to be able to do it and that's why we're going to be working with scritch kittens um, which is a great adoption resource resource um, they do great for adoptions they do great for just overall existing they are wonderful people and uh, the woman that runs it is the most sweetest person she is so kind, so caring, and it will give us the opportunity to include more things like education on chickens, education on snakes, like the ones that I have behind me. I have two snakes behind me right now that will be a part of our family over there as they are currently a part of us. We'll include introductions to dog care and so on we have it all planned out. We really do. It's going to be amazing. We have the vendors. We ha this is this is what I'm talking about. We we have the vendors. We have the programs. We can include VIP Pet Care, which is another organization. We just need to match the funds and so forth. So we're going to, and this is the boring part, we're going to start in it, we're going to start looking into getting loans for it. Um, again, if this location does not work out, the location that the old store that is no longer going to be there does not work out, we do have other options. And the community is being so supportive. The, the, the surrounding businesses and the surrounding people, the homes, the families, the schools, they want us to stay here. They want a feed store here. And this is what we're talking about. There is a community that needs us, that needs feed stores, but they're all vanishing. Not from the changing of tides, not from the changing of needs, because a lot of people actually have livestock animals. It's a rising uh, population. The issue is marketing and housing and so on and so forth. And so it's the properties that are unfortunately just being sold. And a lot of the times it's because of um, the owners of said businesses unfortunately not being able to run it anymore physically or even mentally um, because running a business takes a heavy toll on you. I, I don't care who you are. I don't care how young, how old, how 
whatever, it takes a toll. And that is something that we understand. It is something we are going to fight tooth and nail to make happen and to make real. And we are going to, we are going to fight to keep our found family together. And I keep on saying found family. We found each other through the, the business that is no longer going to be here. We found each other and we connected and we want to stay together. We want to build something together, something that we can all be proud of, something that we can all have a hand in, have a say in, and something that can continue to build our community and to help our community prosper. This is a long this is a long way of saying we are going to help build the community and we would like your guys' help as well. Thank you. Catch you around the corner.